Alrighty, good afternoon. It is June 24th, 2021. It is vlog 115. I did not do a vlog yesterday. I guess I got lazy. I can't do that a lot. Once you get lazy, it's not not good. I just wasn't, like, yesterday was busy, but I will tell you about it. I had a busy day yesterday. You know, I just wasn't feeling it, but it's all good. Uh, I do have a recap, though, of Wednesday. Let's look at the weather, because right now it's a really nice day. Uh, today, I've just been actually, we've been on Zoom calls. I just got off another Zoom call, um, just talking to people about business and stuff, and it was fun. Um, sound healing, actually. We were talking about sound healing today. It was cool. And then we had a, another business thing that we were doing, so... That's looking good too. Yay. Uh, but anyways, today's weather. Let's see if I have it. All right, cool. Bum, 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 bum. Today's weather 72, sunny with a high of 73. So right now we're chilling. It's a nice day. I might go for a walk. It's good to get outside, right? Um, but yeah, yesterday, Wednesday. I was lazy, didn't do a vlog because actually I had a slow morning at first. Um, but, you know, just doing follow ups on customers from DII, you know, things like that. Uh, but Dave did get back from Alaska, so I did talk to him that uh, yesterday just about some things. It was cool. We had a mini meeting. Carrie and Kaylee went shopping. They decided to have a daughter uh, mommy, mommy day, and so I was chilling. But I just chilled out till around two because that's usually when I have to go over to Palos Verdes and actually yesterday I was been on a juice diet my, my stomach's been kind of weird so I just trying to cleanse it out but it was good actually makes you feel better um, Maddie hand pan lesson uh, actually I shared with them my new song it was kind of cool because they wanted to hear it but the cool thing was uh, Maddie actually played with me with the hand pan and I purposely did my new song uh, in the the, uh, the scale of D minor or the key of D minor so you can play with uh, a Celtic minor hand pan which is cool um, but we were jamming a little bit and not only with the song but we were just jamming a little bit her fingers again it's just I see her every week so I can see the slow progression of how she's getting better at hitting and striking and then um, also harmonizing with the notes, which is really good. She just needs to keep on practicing. And then I started her on the Austin Funk because I kind of want to like, have some jams that she can jam with me. And um, yeah, I started teaching her that and she got it really quick. She's just, it's just she's young and wants to do her own thing. You know, <laughs> it's kind of funny, but it's cool. It just makes her, you know, it's good. She's she has she has a mission. She knows what she wants to do. It's kind of awesome. And then Stephanie and Tim were cool. Um, we always have good conversations. The only thing we usually kind of stay over because I usually have like three to four, and then we end up talking for a little bit. Um, but uh, this time they had to leave at four because they were taking the dogs for their. They had to get vaccinated, so they did that. But it was a good lesson. Uh, Maddie and Hattie are awesome. And Maddie is doing great. She's um, slowly progressing, which, yeah, that's what happens. Um, Uke Social was with Teddy, Nikki, and Dean. And Teddy is a new uh, a new person that I met, um, Hoku, who is an uh, awesome singer, ukulele player in the area in Long Beach, and has a group, but she has one of her... I guess one of her friends wants to play ukulele, I guess. And um, he came on to check it out. He's in Laguna, and I think he wants to get lessons or just wants to play music. He's trying to figure it out. But he has an ukulele, and, um, yeah, he wants to learn that. And I showed him. We talked about it last night, and he was he was pretty cool, you know, what he's trying to do. <laughs> So, but we always have a good session. Nikki came on first, and then Dean came on later, and then, um, yeah, it was good. And then, uh, had a great session. I also shared with them my new song, which I'll probably, like, I think I'm almost comfortable enough to, I'll just do a video on it. And you will see that soon. It'll be cool. 
But it was just a little out of tired, uh, tired afterwards, and I didn't feel like filming. Be like, that's what I wrote here. And then we had fish nuggets for dinner, actually. That was since Tuesday. All Tuesday, I was on a liquid diet. Wednesday, all the way up to night. And then ran out of juices, so now I'm eating. But I, I was kind of hungry, so it was cool. But other than that, uh, that's what I've been doing today. I had a great talk, business talks, and, um, you know, sound. I've been, lately it's been coming faster, but my research on sound healing and music therapy, which those are two things, and coming up with a program to help people realize this, help them, help people with their maybe, maybe, uh, Benefits of sound healing are stress, anxiety, helps with stress, anxiety, pain, improves moods, and spiritual well-being. And um, that's I want to come up with a program where I can help people with that. I think I'm going to call it like sound tuning instead of sound bath or sound massage. Sounds good too. But either way, it helps you feel good, which is amazing. Through sound, just through sound. Hmm. Why do we like music? It's pretty crazy. Actually, what were the questions that came up? Uh, um, yeah, I was trying to figure out like the different. There's two types of practices: music theory and music sound therapy, or ther music therapy and sound therapy. I can't even talk. And music therapy is like a prescribed like a from a doctor, and sound therapy is just in a nutshell is like preventative and usually has to deal with frequencies of sound affecting your body whereas music therapy is like here's a diagnosis play the ukulele to help with your connections in your mind or something like that but those are the two differences i what we're trying to do is more of sound therapy which is sound healing and sound bath which they don't have a lot of studies on, but I have been studying a little bit and seeing what the benefits are, which I just told you. And But I think right now it's kind of like trending. So yeah, there's no real structure for like a lot of the sound bath things that we do or what you're trying to do, I guess. I've been to a few that were good and some, they're all good. I think the sound is good. It's just, I think I want a more practical, for me, I just want a more practical way of, doing it and how it affects me you know and stuff like that and talking today I, I think I came up with what we need to do so that's going to be coming soon too so um, I'm just excited just figuring out stuff talking to people it's interesting how you kind of have like a mind meld and it was just zoom calls and we we're talking about ideas that we're going to implement for the future which are going to benefit people in general which is cool I guess that's just business awesome but um, I think it's a good day. Today's Thursday. Uh, usually Thursday is like a chill day, which is happening. Um, it was just meetings. And then I think I'm going to play some music. Maybe I'll record my new song. I have to feel it. But I think I, I just need to practice a little bit more and get it down. But it's coming soon, and people are liking it, so I'm excited. So with that, it is... Where's my book? It is Thursday. It is June 24th. It is... I already did a tuning today. Actually, no, I didn't. I'm going to do a tuning right now. Okay, it is June 24th, it is Thursday. It is vlog. Where's the alarm at? at 1.15, it's funny, I'm at the end of my writing book, so I have to go get a new one. Ah, oh, that's what I'll do, I'll order a new, new thing. But yeah, and yeah, it's vlog for 1.15, and like always, every day, keep on strumming ukulele. See you tomorrow.